We welcome a new year. A new COVID variant is on the rise. It's called XBB 1.5, and the Centers for Disease Control continue to monitor its impact. In the United States, it's about 40% of all COVID cases are caused by this variant right now, although in our part of the country, it's only 6% of cases, so we're going to see more of it. In fact, medical experts say the variant has been in the U.S. for several months now and is the culprit for why COVID numbers are quickly rising in the Northeast and could very well cause COVID cases to rise in other parts of the country, including right here in the Midwest. It's been floating around since October, but in the last few weeks, it's been doubling almost every week. Doctors say they're already seeing increases in the case numbers at their hospitals. They've been averaging at about 200 patients admitted a day um, with COVID, uh, again, not necessarily for COVID, and now it's around 250. Um, so it's a little higher. Henry Ford Health also seeing an increase. Before the holidays, I think we were between 90 to 100 patients admitted with COVID across the whole system. This morning we were at 120 across the system. So what do medical professionals know about this new variant? Since XBB really arose in China, and this is very similar to it, it probably also came from China. It seem maybe it's a little more contagious uh, than some of the prior ones, but it's not hugely more contagious. It's not like the difference between Delta and Omicron. But will the most recent booster designed to protect against Omicron be effective and provide protection against this newest variant? There's probably some degree of protection. I doubt it's as good as it was for BA4 and BA5, but any protection is better than none. And as doctors continue to monitor what's happening in Southeast Michigan with this new variant, they say they will look to the state of New York for answers. They're the ones who've had this, the most cases of this XBB 1.5. So as we see what happens there over the next week or so, that should give us a better glimpse about what we should expect. As for the bigger picture of what could happen with COVID, some are looking overseas. You know, everybody's been very worried about what's going on in China, right? So China's been, their numbers have been going up. And if it gets out of control there, is it going to become sort of a breeding ground for new variants? In Southfield, Ingrid Kelly, Fox 2 News.